Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, if you guys haven't noticed, I cut my hair this past week and I'm super excited that I did. I feel like I needed something new and something fresh because I've always had long hair. So in this tutorial, I am going to show you guys my makeup for my first day of school and my hair that I'm going to do. I really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Please let me know what you guys think. And I feel like I have something else to say. Also, I did want to mention that I'm attending BeautyCon New York October 1st. If you guys are attending BeautyCon, please let me know down below. If you guys want to see how I achieved this hairstyle and my makeup, then keep on watching. So I'm just going to prime my skin before I apply all of my makeup. And the reason why I apply primer is because I want my makeup to last all day. So I'm going to use the Professional Matte Rescue Primer by Benefit Cosmetics. I need to buy a new one. I'm running out. If any of you guys know of any other primer that is good for combination skin, please let me know because I'm on a hunt for a new one. So I'm just going to rub this in all over my face. So the next thing I'm going to apply on my skin is the Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser Primer and I'm going to use this to minimize my pores. For eyebrows today, I am using the Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, Dip Brow Pomade in dark brown. So I'm just going to comb out my brows first and then fill them in. I like to go back and forth with eyebrow products because usually I hate sticking to one. So I usually go from the brow pencil to the dip brow to powder. conceal my eyebrows I am using the LA Girl Pro Conceal in medium beige I love using this concealer to conceal my eyebrows for foundation today I am using the Clinique stay matte oil free makeup foundation and this is in the shade 20 which is deep neutral. I'm not sure if this is going to match my skin at the moment. Um, I did use this foundation when I was a little bit darker than what I am today. I haven't been tanning, like I haven't been laying out in the sun, so hopefully it does match me. If not, we're going to make it work. Please bear with me. <laughs> you can tell that it's a little bit more, it's like a little orange and a little bit darker than my skin complexion right now, but this is what I have at the moment. And I wanted to use a different foundation from my last video. I'm gonna use the Born This Way uh, Too Faced foundation. I mean, this is not a foundation, this is a concealer. And this is in the shade Medium. So I'm just going to pat this in and I'm going back and forth. So I'm just going to take what's left over of the RCMA powder and set the rest of my face. And I'm using a Real Techniques uh, powder brush. So I'm just going to contour a little bit today. I'm using the contour color in Complicated by Makeup Geek. This is a cool medium uh, contour shade. They actually were generous to send this to me and all of these eyeshadow shades. So I'm actually really excited. I'm not going to be using a lot of Makeup Geek eyeshadows today, but I am going to use maybe one. But if you guys do want to see a Makeup Geek makeup tutorial for 
the future or maybe my next video please let me know and I will be happy to make that for you guys so I'm gonna use the morphe m141 brush to contour my face and I'm just gonna make this cute face <laughs> Alright, so for bronzer today, I'm using the NYC Smooth Skin Bronzing Face Powder in Sunny. <laughs> So for blush today, I'm using this blush from Makeup Geek, which is called uh, Valentine. So it's highlight time, which is my favorite time. <laughs> so corny, oh my god. All right. And for highlight today, I'm going to use my Anastasia Glow Kit in Sun Dipped. And I'm going to use Summer. I'm going to use my Laura Geller Gilded Honey Highlighter. And I'm going to apply this with my Anastasia A23 brush. apply one eyeshadow in my uh, crease because I don't really wear eyeshadows to school so I'm gonna use Tiki Hut from Makeup Geek eyeshadows and I'm using my Morphe M504 brush I'm going to apply my velour lashes in girl you're crazy which looks like this they're very wispy and they're not as long while I let this dry you guys should let me know if you guys already started school and also let me know if you guys are in high school and what grade or if you're in college let me know how many years you've been in college just let me know down below I'm really curious I'm going into my third year of college, so I'm a junior in college. I feel like I just started college not too long ago. It's like crazy. Since I'm not applying any liquid liner, I want to make sure that I apply my lash closer to my lash line. Right, so that's pretty much it for my face. I'm not going to do anything more than this. For my lips today, I'm using the Kylie Cosmetics. Dolce K Lip Liner. For lip gloss today, I'm using the Ultra Glossy Lip in WeHo. <laughs> WeHo, I think that's how you pronounce it. <laughs> and I'm going to apply this all over my lips. Okay, so that's pretty much it for the face. Now moving on to my hair. You guys already saw that my hair is short. I cut it this past week and I'm actually really obsessed with it. I do not want to go back to long hair. I love my hair short. I feel like I look like a different person, which I like. So yeah, a lot of people say that I look younger or a lot of people say that I actually look older. What do you guys think? Do I look older or do I look younger? You guys let me know. I don't actually want like the Shirley Temple curls. I want to do waves. So I'm going to use the Hot Tools Professional Wand. And I don't remember how thick the wand is. I will try to uh, search it up and I will probably link it down below so you guys can find it as well if you guys are looking for a wand. The opposite direction and I'm going to do that throughout my entire head so I'm just going to speed up this process
Okay, so once you curl your entire head, I feel like they're a little bit too tight for my liking, so I'm just going to run my fingers through my hair. I hope you guys have an amazing first day of school. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And also, don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.